stick came with a large more man as a clip in the nigga i ain't got no hey guys it's not and and welcome back to my channel so as you guys read by the title i'm about to film a cookie with me Ooh, la, la. but first I have to go to the grocery store. Am I really hungry right now? Yes. Do I have a list that I curated without my mom's help? Yes. March 26th. 12 20 on a dot. The past two days have been really good for me, I feel like. Even though I've been, you know, on quarantine, it's just I'm feeling really productive. Last two days I've exercised, gotten up and did something productive. I can say before these last two days, you know, did not catch me doing any of this in my bed. Really feeling like down, but like I've gotten to the point where like I don't even want to feel down anymore because like there's literally nothing you can do. So for today's look, put my hair like up in the back and then i did my edges i did a little sun i have like these two things in the front and then i have on so the brand shirt link in the bio i have my cardigan which i haven't worn my cardigan yet i got it like four or five months ago but i'm wearing it today it's super cute and my favorite part about this cardigan is that like you can see my tattoo still and it has pocket double cheeked up on a thursday afternoon it's 4 36 in the morning and either i'm delirious or that was actually really funny because it was actually if you go back on your calendar or your phone it was actually thursday goodbye and for shoes i'm wearing my color block vans i'm about to make a tiktok real quick because i feel like it i'm out of here go big rex I look like somebody's mom. I'm making chicken pesto. Like, if you've ever been to Tropical Smoothie, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And I'm craving one, but I don't feel like going to get it from Tropical Smoothie. Instead, I'm just gonna make my own. So, I'm actually about to go. I just need to get my wallet. I made some room changes. I know I probably should have filmed it when I deep cleaned my room yesterday, but it was kind of like a spur of the moment. So, let me show y'all real quick. So, I just have this right here now. And then look at my freshly vacuumed floors. And then I have my desk over here with all the stuff. I have like this little lawn chair at what I'm gonna use to sit and like record and do my makeup. I high key hope Starbucks is open. Cause I need some coffee. Like <laughs> I haven't had any coffee in so long. I'll hit y'all up when I'm in the car. I'm in the car. I'm letting it run because I don't like literally don't drive my car anymore at this point. I don't know. Some people don't let cars run regardless if they're old or new. My mom and dad always told me to let my car run. Why do they just keep coming untied? It's gotten to a point where I've got so bored that I now play the Kardashian game again. Next caller. Next caller. Next caller. I still have a full tank of gas from literally like two weeks. We can talk to you guys when I get to the grocery store. So, I'm in the grocery store right now. I just wiped down my car if you guys were wondering, you know, if anybody was concerned. But I mean, frozen food section is pretty stocked over here, but I should have showed you guys like the paper towel. After this, I'm gonna show you guys the paper towel section is like completely empty. Like this peanut butter, but not the almond kind, and they don't have it. They only have crunchy. I don't eat crunchy peanut butter. This is disgusting. I guess you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. It is what it is. It is, it is what it is. <laughs> Look at this. It's literally empty. I think I want to take a thumbnail. Okay, I hope I got it. Hello, people. It is I. Well, first of all, 
the clips y'all just saw before this those was honestly like a week ago that day i came home and there was food already cooked for me so then obviously i didn't cook and i just ate the food that was cooked for me and then every day it's just been food on top of food, food but today i said forget it when i went to the grocery store they didn't have any flatbread so i'm already kind of at a loss here but i was like you know what i'll settle i'm gonna just settle for this regular wrap now this is good i'm not even gonna sleep on it so my chicken is defrosted and the recipe i just read is to bake the chicken first i kind of want to grill it though well you were wondering it's currently now 5 30 in the morning and i'm still not tired yet what was I thinking? Yeah, I was just thinking like that's really funny how this is basically how my life goes. Like, you know, I hear something one way and then I'm like, well, I kinda do it my way. And usually most of the time it always comes out right. Like everything usually always just flows. Do y'all do the same thing or not? I hope y'all enjoyed this video so far. If y'all did make it this far, please comment and give it a thumbs up. Maybe share it with your friends. I'll cut it, grill it on the stove, and then I'm gonna have my little wrap. And we're gonna see how this guy. First things first is we're gonna wash our hands. 20 seconds. The ingredients that I do have today, I have my wraps. Boneless, skinless chicken breast. Any chicken. It just dripped on me. Um, I couldn't find any chicken cutlets because, I mean, we are in the middle of a pandemic. So, like, a lot of stuff I couldn't find. That's probably why I couldn't find flatbread either. The pesto sauce, which is gonna bring this whole gonna bring this whole meal together oh look at that focus wow and then let me grab some seasonings too that's some seasonings i'll list them on the screen now <laughs> so first we're going to use this pan i'm gonna open this up and we're gonna rinse it off how are you guys this quarantine going um I'm pretty, pretty bored if I do say so myself. Never thought in my life something would happen like this. You know, not to me. This is this is kind of something off the movie if you ask me. Look at that. Wow. It's crazy. So I to the vegetarians out there. Um, if you're a vegetarian, honestly, I say click out. This is not the video for you, Brody. Maybe you just these are what my strips look like all cut up now i'm gonna wash my hands again and now i'm not just continuously washing my hands because of corona i'm washing my hands because i'm handling raw meat cheese we're gonna go ahead and turn on the stove yes sir you're gonna want to take some canola oil just a tad the one time i need tongs i don't even have Honestly, I can cook these all at once. You know, take that seasons over that to the stove, and you're going to season. You're going to season. You know, the chicken cook on the one side, and then in a second we're gonna go ahead and flip it, and then we're gonna let the chicken cook on the other side. If you've never been chopped your spoon before. Usually in these flatbreads, they have tomatoes in it. That's really the only thing, tomatoes, peso, and cheese. So I'm gonna go ahead, I only have these tomatoes because these are the only ones the grocery store has. I'm just gonna cut these up into slices, you know? You know what I mean? Make sure you do rinse your tomatoes. Ooh, I almost forgot about the chicken. I can't help but feel like I don't give up. Okay. Next up, real quick, you wanna take your wrap, turn it in the oven on broil this is just off the top of my head i think it'll work turn your oven on broil and then take your wrap or your flatbread you want to go ahead and just toss it in the oven because you want it just to get a little bit like you know oveny like flatbread -y. <laughs> why did i toss it in there like that now what you want to do is the fun part. My chicken's almost done. That means it's time to start plating. Here we are. I'm going to go ahead and pop this bad boy open. Mmm, smells delicious. We're gonna, it kind of looks like baby throw up, but if you have pesto before, you know it's actually really good. Mix this up a little. Take it and just spread it all over there. Take your cheese. Usually, Tropical Smoothie has mozzarella cheese. If I don't have mozzarella cheese, I'm not leaving the house. 
So we're gonna just sprinkle this in the back. Stick your chicken, lay it on there. Then you have this. Now you wanna take your tomatoes Put them on like so. Ooh, I'm gonna have to make this when I like move and I go to college. That's right here. That girl whipping. This is this is nice. As you guys can see, this is what my end result is. Very, very proud, actually, if I do say my stuff. It looks delicious. But we're gonna take this to my room so we can really taste it, you know? Oh, well, last step, we have to wrap it, obviously. Okay, you guys, so we're back in my room and I'm about to taste it right now. Gotta make sure the bottom is covered. Are y'all ready? I'm not ready. Wow. Oh my God. This is amazing. When I move, I'm literally making this as a lunch, dinner, roommate if you're watching this be prepared this right here is my swag so i'm gonna go hope y'all enjoyed this video if you did give a thumbs up i was gonna make whipped coffee in this video but we gonna say that so if y'all want to see that video then give this video a thumbs up and comment down below also comment some more stuff i should make like comment other things i should make because you know we about to be stuck until how long yeah follow my social medias subscribe and i will talk to you guys in my next video bye